Right, here I am. Mirrors from the wood. The trig point's just up there. I'm going to take some photos of it when I come back. There's a family all having their pictures taken at the moment. I'm meeting up with the track now. Uh, that links up with the trig point up there and should take me down, hopefully, to West Bagborough. Um, I've got a feeling that hill over there, that hill there, I think that is Lydiard Hill. There's another um, big hill or tumuli called Colts Stone, I think it's called, which I had thought of going to. But once again, that can be left for another trip. I've got to just try and get to West Bagborough today. I did want to try and drive there, but it just seems I knew it would be difficult. I might be able to do it another time. Oh, there's somebody coming now. I know, just let them go a minute. Right, over and out a minute. Just let them go. Will's neck. <sighs> now, this will be a short video. What I'm going to do is turn off and um, if you're sometimes if they're too short, I get rid of them, but I want to take some photos a minute of the trick point from here. There's another like, little mound there. Another way for the trick point there. And, and you've got all the trees and that over there, you see. I just wait for that family to go. You do have to be so careful when you're out. So there it is, there's a trick point. Before anyone gets on it. Not far from Triscum Stone. The highest point, 386 metres high. The highest hill on the Quantox. I don't know if it's higher than anywhere else in Somerset, I'm not sure. I'd have to look it up again. Right, over and out, everyone. Big ponies these are. Because I'm lost. This is not the time when you feel want to be lost. Is it? This is not the time. I'm videoing this bit because I might have to come back here yet. Um, I'm looking for the walk that'll take me down to uh, West Bagborough, see? What I'll have to do is uh, just keep on this trail for now. Right, we know where we are when we get here. What we don't know is 
is the trail to the Bragbra trail. Oh, those horses are big horses as well. They're, big, they're bigger than ponies. Some are foals. Now, we're a couple here. There was a couple here a minute ago. They seem to have disappeared already. Of course, I don't know where I am. There's no one about. There's no um, information. You know, there's no sort of signs or anything. They've gone. They disappeared, a couple. Public footpath. Well, what we do, we just carry on down here. I don't want to go on that side of the valley. Should have been over at 10 in the morning, Sheila. You're making this error all the time. You're getting later and later. <sighs> and of course, you know, you've got to get there before four o'clock. And so you'll get there and it'll be shut. You don't even got to do the outside. Look at that big valley down there. I wonder where those people went. There's supposed to be a car park around here somewhere. I think this th this leads to Lydiard Hill. But I don't know where those people... Oh, there's a cyclist. Let me just turn off the camera. Right, there's a number of short videos, everyone. Because um, there's people coming and going, but no one seems to know anything. There's people cycling up here, but they haven't got a clue where, like, the local villages are. <sighs> there was a turning back there, but how did I know that was the right one? I didn't want to go down into some deep, muddy gully to find I was nowhere near West Bagborough. <sighs> I'm sure the woman who came... I, I spoke to up on the trick point last time, said she'd parked up here, and... Um, and that you could get from West Bagborough from there. I've made this quite a big thing, really. I mean, this is why I wanted to drive to the church. Because I had this um, feeling it would be another long walk. And it's always long when you don't know it. That's what I mean. When you don't know the walk. And there's an urgency. I mean, I know the way back, I know where I am, but I don't know where the church is. I'd never brought my glasses either. And there's hardly anyone out today. There's no knowledgeable people. What I mean by that is there's nobody with any local knowledge. There's no boards either. I haven't seen any boards. There was a, a man and a woman and a child. That's the way we're ghosts. They totally disappeared. Now I'm just going to go over here and see if I can see anything down in the valley at all. No, I doubt it. It's going to be down there, Sheila. Don't worry. This is the the thing. When I the thing is, I've rushed really. Um, I should have got up much earlier. When I know I'm coming over here, I should have got up much earlier. So I've got a feeling there's Ashholt Church down there in the valley. Isn't it funny there's no one about? Do you think it's because um, the kids are getting ready for school and no one's really doing a lot today and they're all staying at home and having barbecues? Or there might be a big match on the, on the screen somewhere. But it's a lovely walk, but this is all part of the walk when there's anxious moments. This is all part of the walk. When there's anxious moments, like 
like I said, I could have gone down that other gully. I reckon that'll take you to Lydia Hill. Looks like you can go down there. Oh, it's so difficult to know, isn't it? With no one to ask, no help. What I'll do, I'll get the book, I'll get the map out now and I'll try and make it out. That looks like a way down there, doesn't it? Look at the state of it, though. Oh. Look, there's no, there's nothing. Hold on, there's something there. But will I be able to read it? No, I won't be able to read it. I'm showing all this because this is part of the exploration, what happens. Didn't bring the glasses today. I've got to use the magnifier and I... Middle Hill, Lydiard Hill, Stout Lane, Milton Farm, that sounds familiar, Milton Farm.